back. I am uh, going to be doing a little bit of stream of the Street Fighter 2 Turbo, the beta version of it. Um, yeah, this game uh, came out, didn't, didn't come out, it's a beta version. And I kind of like it a little better than the retail version that did come out for the Sega Genesis because of the music. It's got the more bass, more beat to it, and it's got the KO music to it, which when you're low on energy, it switches to the critical music. But uh, I'm going to do a playthrough uh, with M. Bison, so I'm going to crank it up to level 7. Um, let's go ahead and do that. Hopefully I'll beat it. <laughs> Uh, anyway, if you saw my stream for Streets of Rage, uh, I didn't do too well on that, but uh, we will try this. I'm going to go ahead and uh, just move that up a little bit. There we go. Perfect. All right, let's go in to start the battle. All right, I'm going to pick M. Bison, uh, of course. So he is going to be my uh, go-to guy. Uh, I think I'll pick the green the green, uh, pine green, or whatever you want to call them. All right, here we go. We got Chun Li right there, waiting. All right. Of course, once again, these are uh, this is the real hardware with HD retrovision cables. Not emulated. I try to avoid emulation when I can, but I mean, I know sometimes it's a necessary evil. But like I said, the more emulation gets better, the, the more I'm going to prove it, just because these games have to be preserved. They're not going to last forever. Um, I like to see it; these games preserved for future generations to check out. And I'd like the emulation to be as accurate as possible. But for now, I'm trying to play it all on original, real hardware. Just so you can kind of get an idea of what, how it's supposed to sound and look and feel and maybe smell. I don't know. Anyway, here we go. Chun Li. There we go. Not too bad. I I'm pretty decent with M. Bison. Just checking that out. Kind of checking my uh, feed right there and also checking the. Uh, I got this hooked up to my CRT. It looks beautiful. It looks amazing on my CRT television. So. Scan lines and everything. All right, here we go. Boom. Yeah, this was, um, I've seen this pictures of this game in Game Fan Magazine back in the day, and this was, I think, the version that they were showing, but it never made it out the door. They, they went with a completely different version for the official release, and it's not bad, but this, this one does have some uh, merits to it. Like, I do kind of like the music better on this one than the retail version. Yeah, Street Fighter 2 Turbo Edition. Alright, we are moving right along there. Of course, this was a very popular arcade game. the little tricks you can do with uh, bison. Oh, I was going for a perfect there. There we go. Oh, watch this, watch this. Uh, oh, I was trying to get uh, toasted there. Let's try to land right on that fireball. I don't know, it might have went through me anyway. Who knows? There we 
go. Of course, I am playing with the Sega Genesis 6 button controller. Love this controller, I'm telling you right now. It's an amazing controller. This one and the Sega Saturn 6 button controller are, are two of the most amazing controllers for fighting games. All right, oh boy, you. There we go. It's those slow fireballs that get you. There we go. Not too bad. When he pauses, when he stops like that, he's either going for a dragon punch or a hurricane kick. You kind of get used to what the computer's doing after so many years of playing this game. I've been playing this game for, what, 25 years now? <laughs> So yeah. All right. Bonus stage. Ah. I usually start off with a scissor kick. With him, I just alternate medium and high punch, kind of. It's a little bit quicker to get the car. There we go. All right, who's up next? E Honda from Japan. The arcade version, you can spam that move like so many times because it, it takes more hits when they block. This one, they kind of loosened up on it. of slow down there when he did the hundred hand slap a hint which is probably well, I mean you know it's a beta game so you can't really complain about it all right here we go Brazil Boom. Alright. 
cool. I took care of that. Big old snake wrapped around the tree there. Just like looking all happy. It's like, hey, look at me. Look at me. Hi. All right, here we go. Ah, I figured he would do that. Oh! Desperation move there. Alright. Moving right along. Alright, USA. USA! Not too hard. Sonic Boom! Give him the, a low short kick. You can he'll he'll usually fall for that. Just checking my screen there. That's why I keep glancing over. All right, here we go. stage. You miss one barrel. Ah. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Whew. Man, that was close. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Just keep jumping now. Jab. Not too bad, easy enough. Again, once you kind of learn some of the combos, you you can kind of work your way through it. Ow! All right, Spain. He's not too hard either. You got key is to let him jump off the side there. Off the side of the wall on the right side right. Well, come on. Alright, he's not doing it. There we go. Yeah. That's all I gotta do with him. Yep. Easy. There we go. Tiger! Tiger! Doppelganger. Right, here we go. Or am I the doppelganger?
man. That's what I was trying to do the first round, kind of throw my torpedo and I messed it up. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, no! Seriously! I don't lose! I never lose! I lost. But I lost. Can you believe that? Wow. I lost. Yeah, this does not have the complete ending either. Meaning they don't have like the credits or whatever, you know, after the ending, they don't have all the like credits and stuff. It just says like, thank you, or game over or something like that. Ugh, I might have to go through that again. Ugh, I don't like getting beat. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's see if I enter my initials. Well. See, congratulations. So yeah, this is like an incomplete beta. I mean, they, they did a pretty good job for what, what's out there. I mean, I really like it. I mean, I just like the music, I think, better than <laughs> than the retail release of the game. But uh, anyhow, that was Street Fighter 2 Turbo. That was on the hardest setting, level 7. Like I said, I usually don't lose, but I did. Uh, I'll go through I'll play it again, though, another time. But anyway... Thanks again for joining me. I uh, just did a little run of Street Fighter 2 Turbo. I figured, why not? For the Sega Genesis, the unreleased beta version. So, take care, everybody. Um, I might be back later to do a little bit more. Uh, you know, just chilling out. Getting my uh, streaming going. All right. Take care.